Hi, Twin Flames. What's going on in your Twin Flame journey? What does Spirit want to share with you? This is the Sacred Geometry of Relationships Oracle by Lon. It's a beautiful deck that I have for you today. Um, and let's find out. This is a, sh a quick message for you. Um, so watch it all the way through. You're going to get a lot of information in a little bit of time. So what's going on? What do you need to see? Got balance coming out. So first, pay attention to that symbol. These images invoke a spiritual meaning. So it's not just a random image. It's the image that leads these particular cards and the words follow. The words say, the frequency of balance supports our ability to find harmony with all aspects of our three-dimensional and multi-dimensional layers of reality. And what this communicates to me about your twin flame union is that you're kind of myopic. You're like looking at just one aspect of your union. And I want to define the word union. Union and love are the same thing. Um, when you go into your heart and you feel into your union, what you're doing is you're not feeling into the person who's your twin flame. It's not just about the romantic side. It's about all of you, all of who you are, your uh, divine life purpose, your um, ability to shine, your ability to be creative. That's part of who you are. Um, it is including your twin flame, but it, that's not. That's just one small aspect of your relationship with your divine self, right? There's so many other aspects to explore, and if you're if you're just dead set on focusing on that twin flame person only, and, and I'm not saying don't think about them, but um, you need to find balance in yourself about yourself, about who you are, and like zoom out a little bit. Like your twin flame is part of it, right? Like, but they're not the whole thing. They're an important piece. So I hope that that helps you to find balance. Let's do your next card. Originality. The frequency of originality supports our capacity to be unique and original creators of unlimited possibilities in every moment. So being creative and being original are very synonymous as well. And you need to learn that your twin flame journey is not going to look like someone else's. There are commonalities, like we all see signs and synchronicities. We all know that this is our person. Um, we all know we're on a twin flame journey, but your union's not going to look like other people's. My union doesn't look like anyone else's. That Your whole twin flame union, both wings of the bird, both sides of the figure eight uh, infinity symbol, that's as unique as a thumbprint, right? Everybody's thumbprint is different. So stop comparing yourself to others because that's just going to hinder your progress. Let's keep going. We got time. Now, a lot of people don't like time because you either don't have enough of it or you feel like something's taking too long. And so the truth about time is that there's only now. There's only now, now. I remember the movie Spaceballs, if anyone has seen that movie from the 80s and um, there's a really fun scene called when will then be now and they kind of play around with the concept of time it's really funny you can look that up but here the message on the card says the energy of time supports our understanding of the real relativity of time and our capacity to be present in the moment so about time it's about you being present in the moment and letting go of what happened before and letting go of future tripping as i call it going on a future trip um what will happen if, like really surrender and the best way to come into the present moment that I'm going to share with you now is to feel your feelings. How do I feel right now? And my twin flame just sneezed. <laughs> How do I feel right now? What, what's, what do I feel? Do I feel agitated? Do I feel worried? And really be like the princess in the pea and really be sensitive about your feelings. Like do you notice a tiny little, little nudge somewhere in your heart that doesn't feel good? Like the pea underneath all those mattresses, right? Like, be very sensitive and feel your feelings. That's going to bring you into the present moment. And in fact, you need to feel your feelings in order to do the mirror exercise that Jeff and Shalia teach. Let's do a couple more. We've got second chakra. The energy of the second chakra, sacral chakra helps us to navigate our lives through our emotions and supports our ability to enjoy the sensual world. So that's all five senses and six if you include intuition. Um, the second chakra, a lot of people think of it as the sex chakra. 
It is, but it's also your seat of creativity and um, passion, right? And going out and it's, it's one of the lower chakras that helps tie you to earth. And I want to tell you a secret about twin flames. Twin flames are designed to ascend here on earth, like bringing the earth vibration into enlightenment, not go, you know, in the past people ascend and they left earth. They, they turned into ethereal beings or, um, light beings and left. Well, here we're, we're now um, coming into a new era where twin flames get to ascend on earth and have worldly things, not attached to the worldly things, but you do get to have money, um, romance, you know, all the things that in, in days of old, like in spirituality, that was like a no, no, but now you get to have those things. And that's the beauty of the twin flame journey is ascending here on earth. And part of that is experiencing life on earth with your senses. So go on a nature walk and listen and feel and smell all the, the beauty there. That's one way to wake that up. Another way is cooking. Try cooking something nice. Multidimensionality. Well, that really ties in with the first card that we had, balance. When I spoke of you being um, not, you're not just, you might be hyper-focused focused and fixated on your twin flame and zoom out a bit and see how multidimensional you actually are because you're a divine being. The frequency of multidimensionality activates our awareness of our true essence, which is eternal and multidimensional. So I hope that message hits for you. Um, let me know how you liked it in the comments. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel for juicy Twin Flame content. I produce many videos a week um, from readings to Twin Flame Ascension videos. I've got some playlists you might enjoy. Thank you so much, and I will see you very soon in my next video. Bye-bye.